they have removed Animal Jam. No more Animal Jam toys. Series 1, Series 2, Series 3, Series 4. They're not being made anymore. They're not being shipped to stores. It's over. Good luck trying to find those. So these just got so much rarer. There is no way that you can find them anymore. It's over. Yeah, it's the Shop King. Yeah, it's Shop King time. Hey, what's going on, everybody? Shop King in the house. Ow! Hey, what was that for? Uh-uh. You can't just run up in here and punch me. I'm waiting. I'm looking for you now. Haha. <laughs> oh. Oh. Jeez. What? What the heck was that about? I'm just trying to make a. You know what? I'm out of here. Looks like this is a job for Magenta Shop King. Ha ha ha. You won't get me because I'm way too smart. All right. I'm looking. Oh. Oh. Jeez. I'd like to see you try that again. I will jump right over. Oh my face! Oh, that hurts so bad. Oh, I need some help. What's going on? Oh, I know. I can hide in this cabin. Yes, that hand will never find me here. Ah! Hey, cool. There's a den beta in here. I want to say right off the bat, this is a very important v video. It's very serious. It's one of the most serious videos I've ever made. It's all real. And it's kind of, it's kind of crazy. It's kind of sad, but uh, it's the truth. So uh, to get started, I guess we have to rewind. We have to go back in time, back all the way to 2010. 2010. So Wildworks was developing a game about animals and they partnered with National Geographic and the game became Animal Jam. And this worked out really good for both companies because now Animal Jam is backed by National Geographic. This is a company that's been around for over a hundred years. But late last year is when all of the trouble started. Trouble started. Trouble started. Some of you may not even realize it, but National Geographic disappeared. National Geographic is gone. They are no longer a part of Animal Jam. And this has created a lot of problems, problems. and specifically with their toys. Because as you can see, every single toy has National Geographic on it. All of them, National Geographic. So, you know what? So, you know what? They can't make these anymore. Every single one with a National Geographic thing on it, they're gone. They're done. They're no more. They, it, it, it's over. They, it, it's over. And you can't find it anymore. It's not being made anymore. It's not being sold to stores. And the stores that do have it, they put all of it on clearance. And as soon as they sell that, it's over. It's done. It's over. It's done. I went to all of my local stores, Targets and Walmarts, every store that usually has Animal Jam stuff, they have none and they are getting none more. None more. And it's even more serious. The company that makes all of these toys, Jazzwares, if you go to their website, click on brands, click on all, they have removed Animal Jam. No more Animal Jam toys. So that is extremely disappointing because we had all of these new dens that were supposed to come out in 2017. Guess what? They never came out. All of these new toys they were supposed to come out never came out. The brand new light up rings in association with National Geographic? Nope. Not gonna happen. Oh, but what about the brand new Adopt a Pet series message in a bottle? I was looking forward to those so much. As you can see, it says in association with National Geographic and it's made by Jazzwares. <sighs> not gonna happen. It's not gonna come out. So maybe Animal Jam ended the partnership. Maybe National Geographic ended the partnership. I'm not sure who ended the partnership or why it ended, but it ended. And it's created this big problem because Jazzwares could no longer release all of those toys, all of the stuff that they've made, like the Jama adventure with the pet golden armadillo in association with National Geographic. This was supposed to already be out, but now it will not come out. And the pet fantasy castle den thing, that was supposed to already be out, but of course, 
we never saw it. And with Jazzwares completely removing Animal Jam from their website, this is this is real. This is serious, and uh, um, I'm kind of worried about it. I actually contacted Animal Jam. I'm like, what's up? What's going on? What's the deal, Animal Jam? And they're like, um, we're still partners with Jazzwares, but um, that's about all that we can tell you. So then I contacted Jazzwares, the company that makes all of the toys, all of the adopter pets, and asked them what was going on. They said they no longer sell Animal Jam items anymore. Animal Jam items are no longer in production or distribution. So that means all of the adopter pets out there, that's it. Like, there are no more being made. Well, that means that all of these promos instantly just became a lot more rarer. They're not being made anymore. They're not being shipped to stores. If a store happens to have one, as soon as they sell it, that's it. They're not getting any more ever at all. Period. It's done. A lot of the value for promo items is based on the fact that people feel like, uh, well, I could trade for uh, the, 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 the pet wash hut, but more and more people are going to be getting the pet wash hut all the time. Like there's going to be more and more coming into the game. But now, no, uh-uh, there aren't going to be any more coming into the game. That's it. It's done. And all of the rare pets, these are like impossible to get already. But now it's like triple impossible to get. You will not find these. The adopter pets, series one, series two, series three, series four, and Eclipse and Gem Squad. It's done. It's over. They're not making anymore. Good luck trying to find those. But possibly the biggest impact that this is going to have is on these promo gifts. Uh, specifically the Alpha Sword, the Training Mat, the Helmet, and the Gauntlets. Because look, the sword is 96 codes. 96. You can't go out there and find 96 adopted pets. You can't. It, it, it's not possible. And 180? Forget about it. There's no way. I wouldn't be surprised if the rare Eclipse items go up in value. Crystal Pegasus items, you just can't get them anymore and you'll never be able to get them anymore. So keep an eye out for these. I'm not telling you to go out and try to trade all of your items because they're automatically instantly going to go up. But as soon as people start to learn that this is it, you can't get them anymore, the value will rise. And I contacted Animal Jam and this kind of this kind of sealed it for me. I asked them, what's next? What's what's after the Alpha Gauntlets? What is after 180 codes? Like what's the next item going to be when you put in 210? Will there even be a next item? And you know what they said? They said, we don't know. <laughs> we don't know. Animal Jam said, we're not sure. We, we don't know. So that is so disappointing. I don't know what is going on. Like, uh, maybe National Geographic was also signed on to the deal with Jazzwares. And as soon as National Geographic left, then that sort of ended the deal. Um... So maybe uh, Animal Jam is renegotiating the deal, trying to get things going again. Uh, maybe they're looking for another company, perhaps? I don't know. I don't know. But I really hope they get back into the promo game. But uh, I don't see them re-releasing adopt pets They would have to totally repackage everything, do redo all of the artwork and re-release it. They're never going to do that. If, if they start doing it again, it's going to be a brand new series. And yeah. So the old, all of the old promos, it's done. It's it. Whatever is in the game, that's pretty much it. And there's not going to be very much more coming into the game. And this is actually a bigger problem than you might think because when Animal Jam started to re release toys in 2016 and then 2017, 
like all these kids would go to the store and they would see these toys and they would buy them and they would learn about Animal Jam. You know, they never knew about it before. And so they go to AnimalJam.com and then boom, Animal Jam would get new users. They would sell a toy. They would make a little bit of money off of that. New users, new users, new users and selling toys and new users. And and now with... Uh, they just lost a ton of promotion, see? Because all of those toys promoted the game. And now, no one... No one is seeing those toys in the stores. So they lost out on tons of promotion. I hope they fix... I, man, I hope they work it out. I really do. This exclusive Coyote plushie is a prize that you can get from a Happy Meal from McDonald's. Right now, it appears that they are only in Mexico and Puerto Rico. And that's about 500 McDonald's right there. They're probably in some other countries as well. So that's a whole lot of McDonald's. Like that's a lot of items and a lot of promotion for Animal Jam. And anytime you can sign a deal with McDonald's, that is a huge deal. But if they ever bring it to the United States, that is an even huger deal because there are 15,000 McDonald's in the United States. So that would be crazy if that happens. Plus, it's not like they just stopped making items. They're still putting out tons of merchandise. It looks like the only thing on hold right now is the toys. And I'm sure they are working on getting that back up and running again. Either they're trying to make it happen with Jazzwares, or they're trying to make it happen with a new company. I just hope they figure it out and make it happen soon. And don't forget, most of this video is just me sort of guessing, trying to figure stuff out. Trying to figure out what is going on by piecing together what I have been told, you know? So, it, there may be something totally different going on behind the scenes. But as far as I know from everything that I've read and what I've seen, what I've been told, um, everything I've said is true. But like, I don't know why they broke up. I have no reason. I, I have no idea what went wrong. Um, but they'll figure it out. They have to. So yeah, that's basically it for this video, guys. Uh, those toys are like done. They just ended instantly and abruptly without warning no more animal jam toys which means promos just got a lot more rare and it also means rare pets became extremely difficult to find and the alpha items became basically impossible to get well thanks for watching this video everybody. I actually had to make it about three different times because I kept on getting different information and then I had to redo the video with the new information and then when I was about to upload it, I got new information. So it was, uh, yeah. But anyway, hopefully they figure it out. I'm sure they will. I mean, they've got to, right? Hopefully they figure it out and they can release all of these items that they have been promoting and we've been hearing about. Hopefully those will come out soon. I don't know. Leave your comments down below and let me know what you think about this uh, disaster.